So you might be looking for some of the best text to video type of applications that are available on your iPhone. Now all of these are free for the most part, but you know with most apps there's a bunch of paid stuff you have to kind of get through. So keep that in mind, but for the most part this is a pretty basic, you know, setup. All these apps will be linked down in the description, so you can get them from there completely for free. Now the first one that we can go and take a look at is this one right here. Now with this particular application with NVIDIA AI, this is a pretty basic app. You know, all these ones I've used on different devices. So here you can go and just join with Apple. They kind of make you do it kind of like this every time. And with these types of applications, I will tell you, they're going to be very basic. It's not going to be super crazy. It's going to be very basic. You know, and if you want to do the most craziest things available on these types of applications, they're going to be very, very, you know, they're not going to be the best quality. So that's kind of the best thing to keep in you know, mind. So here what you can do is you can start typing in in this particular app like something. So if I wrote like a cat, you know, walking on down a street, you can see if I go and click generate a video, you can kind of get an idea of what these types of applications can kind of give you. So it might take a little bit of time for it to kind of go ahead and kind of create something. But you can see, as you can see, it says analysis completed, thinking, and it will give us out a video of some sort that you can basically kind of take a look at. Now, all these videos will be kind of all over the place, like I mentioned. They're not going to be perfect or anything like that, but they're going to get the job done. And if you need to go and just make a video for the most part, then you can kind of get it. But this is basically what the output of this type of you know application will look like. And that tells you the audience, you can kind of change it out and click continue. And then this is what the video would essentially look like now. And it takes a long time, so we'll come back to this video. But another one is Haper AI, Halper AI, I don't even know how to say this one. But this is another decent one that I actually like a lot. It's pretty basic. As soon as you just open the application, you just basically just jump into it. It doesn't even allow you to just log in. It just allows you to just kind of break into the thing itself. So here what you can do is you can go and click create with text right here. And you can just go and do the same thing. So if I just went ahead and copied and pasted the same exact thing, a cat walking down the street. If I go and click idea, I just go and click right here. If I click generate right here, sorry. You can see that it's going to go ahead and kind of do the same exact thing. So it's in queue. It's going to take a little bit of time for this thing to go and you know create it as well. So it'll go and kind of bump me whenever it's ready. So it'll go and create these videos right here too. So that's another one. Those are two that are really decent, but again, they take a very long time to go and kind of create. So that's kind of the problem. And you can see with this particular video, if you go and click here, you can see what this video will kind of look like on the other one. And you have audio over it, and you can see this is what the video looks like. So it is actually pretty crazy because it is like a pretty basic video, but it actually is pretty cool. As you can see, I mean, this is kind of what this video would look like theoretically, and it's crazy to think this is not a real like video. There's probably like inaccuracy somewhere. And it, I don't know if this is like, I don't know how real this is. Like, I wonder if this is like taken from like actual videos and they just kind of like parse together like a bunch of random videos. I have no idea. They could be totally doing that. So if it looks familiar to you, then that's that. But that's a really cool app. I like Haper AI too. Like I said, these ones just take a long time for to kind of, you know, create these types of you know videos. There's another website too, which I actually will link down in the description as well. This specific one is Pika Art. So this is not really a, you know, application. It's more of a website. But this is actually one that's really cool too. The only problem with this one is that it is like a paid option. There's like a free trial, which is nice because you can just go through and just have this free trial. But this one is like very, very high end. This one is super crazy. If you're a you know animator or something like that, this one's probably worth the money. But those are probably the best ones I could probably see. This one, Haper AI, I've heard a lot of. But the other one, you know, is probably more reliable because that one you know, just can just be made super fast. But this one, you don't need an account as far as I can tell. So those are the best ones I could find. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything, I also love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.